Hey, what's going on everyone? So, I said I was going to make sure I made a video. And here we go. Alright, so. I made other videos, but... Oh, I'm just having a hard time <clears throat> uploading them. And I also am having a hard time um, trying to find it. Because, um... My my tablet that I made videos on was stolen. All right, so anyway, so twenty two gauge is the best gauge for beginners to use, and also if you're going to use your fingers, is is more pliable, is soft, and on top of that. It's easy to close up um, the the ends. Twenty gauge wire, you'll is easy to use as far as if you're using the proper tools like pliers. <clears throat> so this video is for people that do not have the tools, and for people who just want to save some money. Look, I know it's tough out here. All you need is 22 gauge wire, whether it be copper, brass, gold, um, silver, 22 gauge wire. It has to be dead soft wire. Dead soft meaning it's easy to move. It's easy to move. It's pliable. So, <clears throat> all you have to do is take the wire and curve it around. Make a little C. That's the end. All right, and this is the closure that I'm doing. So I'm going to do the closure first. Let's see if I can get a close up. It's a little blurry. Can you see that, y'all? Can y'all see that? It's a little blurry. Let's see if I can focus. A little blurry. My apologies. I have a DSLR camera that I'm supposed to be doing videos with, but unfortunately I'm having issues with that too. Just want to get a good close up for y'all. Okay, so make a little C, right? <clears throat> you take the tip of your thumb and get the bottom of this and just push it under. Just push it just like that. See how I moved it slightly? And just keep pushing it until it's closed. Until it's closed. Use your thumb, your nail if you have to, and just push it around. Just push it around. Just like this. Let me see if I can get a good close up. Just like that. And just go around, just wrap it around, wrap it around. You're, this is called coiling, just coil it around. And this is the closure of the cuff. This will be on the inside of your nose. This will be on the inside of your nose, cuffing it. Just like that. It's a little blurry. Can we see, can we see? Hopefully y'all can see this good. Just like that. So it's a coil, right? So <clears throat> I usually do about um, an inch. Make sure it's about an inch. This is about an inch right here, right? You don't want to end up. Uh, let's just say it's not even really a whole inch, but... Let's just say it's including, including the cuff, um, the piece that's going to cuff, that's going to secure it into place. This is really what, what holds your, your, your nose cuff, your nose ring into place, right? So from this to this, you need an inch. So right here is an inch, right? This is where you're going to start 
the decorative wrapping. So all you have to do, just take your thumb and gauge where the inch is, wherever the inch is, wherever it ends. This is an inch right here. It looks big on camera. It looks, it looks like it's not an inch, but this is an inch. All right. So just take it and just curve it around just like that. Can we see? Can we see? Make a little song. Can we see? Can we see? I'm going to have to use this as background because I don't know. Hopefully y'all can see this. People took my light bulbs. My husband took my light bulbs out of this room. I bought some other light bulbs, but... I forgot them, but anyway, y'all, I'm sorry. Sorry about the dark lighting. It's really dark. I really wanted to do this during the daytime, but I had to go shopping, y'all. I had to go today. All right, so if you want to put a bead like I'm going to do, go ahead and do that now. I have a little gemstone bead I'm using. Oops. This is a cute little peach gemstone. This is um, quartz. So, let me get this out of the way. Hopefully y'all can see everything. Um, putting the bead on. So what I'm going to do is before I even wrap, I'm, I'm just not going to straight wrap it. I'm going to do a little design first. All right. But like I said, this is very easy. Very, very easy. Just use your fingers and... So what I did was just this. And I made a little angle. So I'm going to hold the bead into place with that angle. I did say I was going to do a little design. Let me do a little design. I'll show you all the design. So just do whatever comes to mind, whatever you feel like you want. You can do a loop. Coils. I'm going to do a little coil. So do the coil just like that. That's how you start it out. And all you do is just hold it down with your thumb and keep wrapping around. All right. So open this up. Open the um, the cuff up a little bit so you can do the design that you want to do. And just hold it with your thumb. Hold the little coil with your thumb and just wrap it around. Wrap it around just like that and just keep going, keep going. I'm gonna go a couple of times. All right, here's the coil. I'm going to add the gemstone. And I'm going to put it at the top. Just like this. I was hoping it was going to be a little more focused. All right, so. And you take the extra and just wrap it around to secure. Wrap it around nice and tight. Wrap it around nice and tight. Alright, 
So this is how it should look. It's not focusing. There we go. This is how it should look, y'all. Still not focused as it should be. Let's hold it up some. All right, this is how it should look. And then you have this little top. Now, right here, you can stop if you'd like. Stop right here if you would like. And just cut this piece off and tuck it under. Tuck it under bottom, the bottom of the nose cuff and you're done. But what I'm going to do is just use the rest of this wire and use my finger. All right. So what we did for the the bottom of the nose cuff, not the bottom, but the end of the nose end of the nose cuff. I can't get this to focus. What we did for the the um the cuff, the part that's going to go on the inside of the nose, we're going to do the same for this up here, right? So just use your thumb, your nail, whatever. You can use your scissors. You can use a little tool. Whatever you choose. So I'm just going around. Just go around. Just like that. All right. Around. And done.